I wish Squad Strike was more prevalent. Yeah, it's fun. I like it. I love squads. All right. Game one. Oh, it starts at the taunt. I don't know why he did that. This is only a crew battle. Yeah. All right. Yeah, Yoshi jab is super safe on shield. You can only grab that if it's like inside of you. Oh, wow. Oh, yep. Double jump armor. So the way it works is down throw fair is never true on Yoshi at any percent ever because yeah. of double jump armor. However, a raw fair can combo into like one fair for uh, like until like mid percents. Okay. It's good knowledge for the nest mains. Yep. Good magnet disadvantage. Fortunately yeah. for A9, he has got a strong lead right now. He does. That's something, uh, Yasha, oh, Yasha, I like, this TV is so blurry. Yeah. <laughs> I also need glasses, but, uh, I definitely need glasses. But this is something that Yasha, uh, was doing earlier where, like, he'll drop down from ledge, double jump down air. If you just stay at roll distance, you can back air that, and, like, it's such a free punish. Yeah, because he puts his, like, big old head out there. I feel like instead of, Yasha's going for grabs, because... A lot of people's first instinct when they fight Yoshi is to just shield all the time because it doesn't really have combo throws. Yeah. But Ooh. neutral B is a very good command grab. Yeah. And it puts you into so many mix-ups. What you want to do against Yoshi is abuse his lack of range and abuse your uh, ground movement. Because Yoshi's ground movement and grounded options suck. All of his tilts are super unsafe on shield. Even down tilt? Like... Ma if it's not max space, yes. Okay. I know, like, the, the one thing about down tilt is at least he's low to the ground, but... Yeah, I mean, yeah. Ness is too. <laughs> yeah, so, there's that. Uh, Yasha, he, I don't know wh when he brought this back, but it's at least, like, kind of close now. Oh. Uh, if he gets, like, one good read, he might kill him, like, right here. That egg on plat, you have to be ready to react to the no tech and up smash it. Yeah. It's a really easy up smash if you can react. Right now, A9 is just covering all this space, okay. keeping him in the corner. I would have gone for F throw there. Usually against Yoshi, since down throw doesn't really combo into anything, usually you just want to go for F throw. At low percents, I like to down throw, and sometimes they'll always they'll always just buffer double jump out of it. Yeah. And sometimes you can get a little cheesy and like hit them like when they're trying to land and then they're off stage at low percents. But usually Yoshi's air mobility is too much for Ness's ground speed to catch it. Mm. Oh, guess the back throw. Yep, nice punish. Oh. Double jump. Oh, wow, I'm shocked gosh. that egg didn't hit. Because that's usually the counterplay to that, is you can hit Ness with Egg yeah. if he's charging it. I'm shocked that Egg didn't hit. The explosion hitbox on that Egg when it hits the ground is so big compared to the Egg itself. I, dude, I didn't even know that it had one of those. Like, I thought it was, I thought I just always got hit, like, it's, from it's, the Egg. Yep, it has explosion. You know it's a multi-hit? It breaks focus. That's crazy. It has two hits. It uh, One doesn't do any damage, but it pops the Egg, and then the other one is the one that does damage. I don't know how you know this. Like, oh my gosh. Dude. I know so much about this character. I have 15 sets with Houdini this season alone. Wow. Lifetime, I'm probably in like the fi like 40s to 50s at this point. That's crazy. I know like everything about this character. Yeah. That's super funny. Like, Yoshi's super niche to See me. See what I mean? Cause... Yoshi's will always do that jump from ledge because they're just like, haha, I'm gonna double jump armor. Yeah. Cause I've, it... actually, I've actually never thought about hard calling that out with Pika Thunder Rocket. Yeah. That's... Just... That was very, very smart. Calculated plays, big brain. <sighs> and I feel like another thing about Yoshi Ness is like, because of the way they're designed, I don't think they really have bad stages, you know? Uh, like, they have stages that like might be mildly annoying. I mean, I'm assuming like Lilat isn't legal or Yoshi's, but like on normal stages. Yeah. All right, I don't know anything about this matchup. <laughs> I don't know either. I low key think Kirby's not as terrible as everyone thinks. I don't know. But it's, it's as long as you camp a lot of the time, like, it shouldn't go his way because he's so slow and, like, he can't jump on you or anything. I feel like Kirby's matchups are either he does fine or he gets absolutely destroyed. Like, for my characters at least, I think this matchup isn't that bad for Kirby. I think slight Ooh. Ness, probably very only slightly Ness. Mm. I think Lucas is, like, slight Lucas. I think Snake destroys Kirby. And then I actually do not think Joker Kirby is that bad. I really don't. Huh. I think that honestly, maybe could be even. It's kind of hard to hit Kirby. Kirby with guns is really scary. Yeah. Um, he low profiles everything, and he can actually like, he can actually like two frame our sense so easy with like down air and like, yeah, different stuff. Yeah. But as for the Ness matchup, it's like, you want to play this really grounded, because if you just try and approach from the air, Kirby actually has pretty decent anti airs. Like, Kirby short hop up air covers so many of Ness's like approaching aerial options because the arc that move has yeah and that move like it can actually kind of kill at like high percents 
the up air. Yeah. Yeah. And it, it, it does combo. Another thing about this matchup is it's like Kirby down tilt in this matchup, like, can also punish Ness for like, if he just crouches and then Ness tries to fair, Kirby can just like mash down tilt. Uh -huh. And then sometimes he'll get like down tilt S smash and stuff like that. Oh. Gosh, with the hard call out. That was a hard call on, out. On A9's landing there. Kirby S smash is another really, really good move that people don't talk about. Yeah, it, he's got some pretty good moves in that kit. It's just, I they think don't, oh, Kurt, the thing with Kirby is like, it's just his regular stats are not good. I so. was I was literally about to say like yeah he has good moves but like Kirby as a character is not like his sprint speed is yeah he's dead. GGS. Yeah. How? Kir I know Kirby's heavier than Jigglypuff but I don't know by how much. Not a lot I don't think. Kirby's light. Kirby's really light. 